How did you go to politics, sir? You know, um, after 18, after uh, one second, mga 14 years in practice, uh, uh, the first election after it's a revolution one. Yeah. Uh, excuse me. Ah, uh, ustomat na mayate kuna na ni Congressman Honorato Aquino at that time. Yes. Who was our Congressman? Seeing that. Okay. We form our uh, group that all the tribes of living in Baguio, the big ones, yeah. by all means should be represented. Set with Bagana. Yes. So the Tayong Highlanders, what I accepted was. We are still Region 1 long time later. Right? Yes. I, che- I will chair the selection committee to select yes. who will be our candidate for councillor. <laughs> And we selected the late Galloway Gang. Yes. So the Pinili Mimotangas. No, Mac election day, Jahat Idi. Rimuara ka nung nga number five. <laughs> so ako na, ay, ni Dumugan. Ay, ano, no, no, no. The decision of the group, our tribe is ni Galo Wigan. <clears throat> so, nakpinekatinagan ko kung ano, ano nga ikabkabil siya. Um, you know, I do not know. Mapay nga kasi at tinupasamak ta. Few days before the deadline of filing, Gal, Uncle Galo Wigan changed his mind. Mm. To run as councillor and instead decided to run for mayor. The oh. Quintana Edi, there were eight or nine candidates for mayor. Mm. There's no Highlander, so he's thinking that if the Highlanders will vote solidly for him, for him. he will come out. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, <laughs> the pan kami, the no way you will win. The Giti leaders, the Igoro have word of honor. They are already committed to a lot of candidates. Oh. Even they will secretly vote for you. Yeah. But they cannot shout for you because of their word of honor. They are committed already. Awak, anamat denggan. Di sana nga denggan. Daitan, that will answer your question. Kunadan, awanin sa balin, sikan. They pinpointed to me, that was how. I start. Because that was done. 1987. The election was uh, the following, I think, February, February 3, uh, 1988. Yeah. Then, after the election, I came out. I was only number eight. Mm. Among the 12 councillors, I was only number eight. That was how it was. So, I brought with me Judith. Because again, yeah. I cannot in conscience left him, left her sure. without any job. I brought her with me in city hall. And then you ran for vice mayor. Yes. yes. You After were... four years, yeah. four years as councillor, oh. chairman of the committee on laws. Awanen kunak subliak manunti private practice. Ah, nakitko ni nagrigat politika. Then. Umay da 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 apo bergara dan ibada ini da Tony Tabur adu da ang pangasin at kakadwatayot ni bergara ti for mayor tabura for ay bergara for kongresman tabura for mayor sikat ti vice mayor han ni ilmo ti kabil yung vice mayor campaign manager ta kaya't mo ang sublinga private practitioner um Eventually, it did not happen that yeah. way because Tirigat, uh, Sin Ming, of course, politicians in the NATO, in 1992, ni Ramos, ni Jose Doy Laurel, ni Danding Ko Huangko, ni Miriam Santiago, adudang katataray nga presidente. Now, nagsisi na muta the duel laurel sa balimut ni danding tikapet mut ni apo bergara ni danding 
Okay. Because of the La Union Black, pinresure na ni Bergara nga ante kadwa mga mayor ni Bungong Ortiga mm. instead of Tabura. So, awanin, ti uh, the vice mayor na ni Ator ni Gini Lim. Uh-huh. Siya ti kunada. So, umay mat na gitata ilmo na da farinya sa tabura eh awan ti haanan a eh oh my kanta tarayak nga mayor kuno ni tabura sikat ti vice mayor councilor de ilmo kastoy kastoy binilang da ay ket nangay nga ron dia na pasubuak manen dita but well uh, you were vice mayor for 15 minutes daw according to no not at, not at all Palabot. because yes what happened was ah uh, <coughs> Alabu uh-huh. was disqualified before election day. Uh-huh. He was disqualified before election day by the Comelec. Mm-hmm. But he appealed to the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court. This, uh, his appeal was still pending mm-hmm. during the proclamation of... We were already proclaimed as winners. Yeah. And even during the oath-taking June 30 of 1992, uh, that was 9 o'clock in the morning. Mm-hmm. That was our oath taking convention center. So there was no decision yet of the mm-hmm. Supreme Court. So what happened was after I took my oath as vice mayor, nine o'clock in the morning, yeah. after 15 minutes, uh-huh. because our function starts at one o'clock oh, in the afternoon, the afternoon yeah. I was asked to take my oath as uh, mayor. The yeah. eye as uh, uh, acting mayor. So as an actor. that was what happened. Mm-hmm. So I did not function at all, even as he can, as the vice mayor. Vice mayor yeah. I immediately function as a mayor. And then October of that same year, 1988, the decision of the Supreme Court came out, mm-hmm. uh, finally disqualifying yeah. Labo. So I was asked again to take my oath as yes, regular mayor. Regular mayor. Uh, so uh, we scheduled that it will be President Ramos because President Ramos was the one who won uh, mm, yeah. the presidential, presidential election. Uh, uh, election. Mm. Nga, it in Tomatwin during the convention of December 1987. Huh? the delegates of Benguet and Baguio, o papat kami lang ng butos ko ni Ramos, layos da nga ni Ramon Mitra ti binutosan da. Because the old man Mitra was the congressman of yes. Baguio Benguet for a long period of time also. Kasi dyan, eh, may sang ni Mitra nga na limaban idi. Mm-hmm. So that was how it was. Uh, 